during stationary swimming against an increasing load, the gas exchange threshold and respiratory compensation point can be readily discerned. Two important parameters to measure during free swimming at an increasing velocity. Intensity progression via load increases during incremental exercise can be symmetrical, gradual, and hopped during tether swimming, which is not the case during incremental free swimming at an increasing velocity. Administering the procedure will be Leandro Oliveira, Luiz Gustavo Santos, and Camila Vasconcelos, graduate students from my laboratory. The swimmer will be Julia Cato, who has been involved in comparative swim training for five years. To prepare the 500 kilogram load cell that will be used to measure the highest force that the swimmer can exert during two trials comprising 30 seconds of all-out swimming, open the N2000 Pro software program and open the help menu to verify the communication link between the computer and the load cell analyzer. When the connection to the RS-232 interface is established, a green signal will appear. Set the countdown to start the test, the sampling duration, and the rest info.